Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do your bonus read for November uh, 15th going into early December. So it's just the energy surrounding you guys. I already pulled the cards just for the sake of time. <clears throat> I did shuffle and pray off camera for you guys. Um, I feel like some of you Sagittarius, you're dealing with loss, loss of uh, life. Uh, dealing with health related issues things moving fast you having to make plans in regards to some of you want your family back or you want a wife or a husband back or somebody's coming back to you Sagittarius let's see what's going on here so we have five card advice spread this is Sagittarius right where they are page of Pentacles wanting to start anew wanting to start over knowing that stability is elsewhere and needing to start make the tangible effort of starting right now you're just having messages of you know you want something back or you want to go back or somebody's coming back to you it's just messages of wanting to start over maybe with the Capricorn Virgo Taurus Sun Moon Rising well, this is you it could be vice versa too somebody's doing this to you or you going back to somebody is uh, Sagittarius on the right path five of wands yeah that's indecision there is competition, indecision, inner conflict. Do am I on my right path? Am I doing the right thing? There's also gossip. There's other people surrounding the situation, so it makes you question. Okay. Main obstacle: What's hindering Sagittarius? Nine of no, Nine of Swords, extreme loss, pain, suffering. You could have lost someone, I could say loss of life. Um, you could actually be in pain. You could be having health related issues, needing to get blood work done, needing to go through um, some health checkup, worrying, stress, sleepless nights, mental unrest, feeling as if everything is on you. Everybody is on you. Stress. Yeah. That's the obstacle here. What's helping you? The Eight of Wands. You communicating maybe with another Aries Sagittarius Leo, Sun Moon Arising. They are giving you some really um, encouraging words. This is nicknamed the arrows of love. This could be loving words, loving and caring uh, communication. But there's communication. It could even be about the trouble and or jealousy in a relationship. You're getting communication either way about trouble in a relationship or uh, getting communi loving communication that, that's helping you. Either or could be helping you. We're hoping that you're getting uh, the first scenario, loving communication here some progressive movement too with this communication a lot of doing a lot of just going and back and forth and, and travel may be why your health may be at, at risk or is a concern for you this is what's helping you your advice here is the four of swords. Yeah, definitely rest, rest your heart, rest your mind, heal from the three of swords. Cast your carries on, cast your worries. I said your carries, Lord. No, cast your worries <laughs> onto um, whatever it is you believe in in the realm of faith and spirituality rest take some rest rest take a time out a retreat from you may even be taking a retreat from an uh, airy Sagittarius way out like yourself because you're needing to heal you need to put self first look what's at the bottom of the deck the chariot could be dealing with a Cancerian person. If not, you just need to put yourself first and move forward. Get in control. You've just been doing stuff and not having a lot of rain, rule, and regimen over your life. You've just been going. And you need to stop and really put things in perspective. Now we've got, it's supposed to be four cards. A fifth one fell out. 
that clear excuse me that clarifies this reading or maybe brings new insight to another Sagittarius out there we've got the Queen of Swords at the bottom of the deck some of you could be dealing with the Gemini in particular or Libra Aquarius but Gemini in particular Somebody's wanting truth from you or you're wanting truth from someone. You're giving truth. You're cutting out with that sword of truth or cutting through. Let's see what this is about. Uh, the Wheel of Fortune. What's happening is destined to happen. The wheel is turning. Um, the wheel turns all the time for us. It's about what you have put out energetically or karmically. It's coming back to you. Uh, Sagittarius is, is, I think, the luckiest sign. So this is probably good fortune here. Page of Swords. Maybe because you cut something off out. You said some words that were frank and cutting. You cut through. You cut something out that you just had, you let just go on. You may also be spying on a child or a child is spying on you or somebody is eavesdropping something that you may be doing research in regards to some type of money making plot scheme string could be dealing with a Leo if not you are um, yeah it's like you're eavesdropping spying on Leo trying to remain strong in the midst of maybe being in something that is not yielding you the exact energy that you you are that you feel like you deserve with the will of fortune here yeah, so. eight of swords and what clarifies that the king of pentacles some of you are trying to stay strong and breaking free of maybe capricorn virgo Taurus, husband you feel stuck here though but you knowing that you need to cut out or cut away You're leaning on um, friends or family. Someone you you don't see face to face all the time. Someone I'm trying to tame yourself in regards to. something you're doing something in regards to money mm. new career okay heavenly signs you might get those as you rest your heart your mind you meditate and you pray Religion and spirituality, yeah, it's like you've been getting some real heavy downloads about all zodiac signs or all something about the zodiac signs. The messages have made you sometimes they're confusing, sometimes it it's clear. Yeah. So this reading's all over the place. That grief work under the deck. Either you're going to a therapist, a counselor, or you are one in some form or fashion. You might be a pastor, do pastoral care, psychic, tarot card reader. You deal with people and, and some that are going through grief you do grief work or you need to do grief work you need to grieve the loss of somebody died here you're making plans 
in regards to their um, them being deceased also having communication about that you might have to travel in regards to that some of you your health you need to slow down because you've just been going and doing yeah it's like a hearse there's the casket yeah it's like something's here somebody lost life could be a father figure the chariot here Will of Fortune, Page of Swords, Strength Card 8. You have to be strong and get in through this. It was, of course, it's supposed to happen. New career. I think heaven is pushing you into a new direction in, in regards to career, but you are um, feeling stuck and tied in one position where you just don't see a way of having either a new career, new business, or whatever. Um, we're going to clarify the other side to see what all this is all about. Um, a dollar 75 to get the extended reading especially those who are out there who are trying to embark on entrepreneurship I, I really think this is a good reading for you to tell you you know if this is the right way for you to go some of you are grieving or uh, have some grief issues or maybe even be might even be embarking on a career path that helps people with grieving go ahead and Get that reading or request your own personal reading by going to the website and booking there booking and paying there or send an email if you are having trouble doing so if you're having trouble going to the website send an email only if you're having trouble um you can always send me an email but if you have not booked and paid and you want to know how to you'll just be redirected to the website it's very convenient it's very straightforward i, I hope so if not send me an email it's all good uh, Sagittarius um, keep in mind you can purchase merchandise that's below the reading um, if you do purchase merchandise you will receive a five minute uh, free five minute uh, consultation with me either via phone or a video recording um, also gift cards for the holidays you can go over to the website purchase those if you purchase any gift card in $50 uh, value or more you'll receive the five minute free consultation with me also um, Sagittarius know that I am praying for you nothing but the highest prayers pray for me as well happy holidays take care bye